How's it going? My name is Rich, and this is my review of the Magic Action Box WordPress plugin by Dean Soto. So, there's a new update he just came out with a couple of fixes, and you're going to have to install it through FTP. So, you're going to want to FTP into your domain. You're going to want to go to WordPress content, plugins. And you're gonna wanna upload the folder magic action box. Once you get that uploaded, you're going to want to refresh your plugins here on your WordPress site and activate the plugin. Now you go to Action Box Settings and you want to I have a Weber so I'm going to connect it to a Weber. It's going to go grab the key, go back, paste that in there, save the changes and now Magic Action Box is paired up with my A Weber account. So now you want to add a new Action Box. Use an opt in form. Then you want to connect it to the list that you actually want to subscribers to be sent to. Then you want to add the thank you page where you want people to be sent after they sign up. So you just want to paste the URL you want people to be sent to after they sign up for your list and choose your box style. Now I've checked them all out and royalty kind of fits with my website, kind of looks nice. Now here's where you want to add the information that's going to be filled in, in in your action box. The main heading, subheading, and the main copy. So you want to fill in your main heading. Put a subheading if you want. Paste in your copy now you choose your opt-in box image what it's going to do is it's going to place an image in the box you can have it to the left to the right or above you can also set the dimensions <laughs> of the image So you want to upload an image or choose one from your media library. Now supposedly he has fixed this so it will actually insert it because it wasn't working before. And it seems as though it's still not working. So, what you want to do is you want to go to your media library, choose your image, or upload it. Either way, you'll get this. The link to the picture is right here, link URL. 
So, you grab that, copy it. Then you want to get rid of it because you don't want the image to link to anything because it's just going to link to itself. So, once you're done, you grab that, close it out, paste your image URL right there. Choose where you want the image. I'm going to stick it to the right. Now, all these designs, settings, you can change. But I chose a pre made box style, so I'm just going to leave it how it is. Publish it. Oh, and put a title. So now you want to go to your posts. Okay, so you want to open up your post. Um, I know it's cut off, but I had to resize it for it to fit here. So you're going to have this drop down here. Just choose the action box that you just made. Choose whether you want it at the top or the bottom of your post. Now this is awesome because it's been proven that the top and bottom of your post are ideal locations. <clears throat> to have your opt-in form the bottom I like to put it at the bottom because if someone's gonna read through all of your posts all the way to the bottom it's a pretty good sign that they wanna they're interested in what you have to say so they're gonna be more apt to up you know opt-in for updates and such so you choose your action box update the post and there it is I hope you liked my review well, it was more of a how to show you how to do things here but I, I do really like this plugin uh, I've never bought anything from Dean Soto before, but after using this, I'm definitely going to keep an eye on his uh, future projects. Thanks for watching. Now, go get your copy of Magic Action Box by Dean Soto.